we are going to discuss treatment of plasmodium falciparum and pregnancy treatment of plasmodium falciparum malaria in pregnancy in the first trimester the drug of choice is quinine with clindamycin quinine in combination with clindamycin given per 7 days in the first trimester in the second and third trimester the recommended drug is act artemisinin in combination therapy for 3 days artemisinin in is used for the treatment of malaria since 1970 artemisinin in and it is derivative derivative is the artemether and artisunate artemether and artisunate are derivatives of artemisinin and artemether is a lipid soluble it should be given im r oral route while artisunate is water soluble it should be given iv r oral route is it clear artemisinin in and it is derivative with combination of other anti malaria drugs who recommended common artemisinin in combination therapy such as artemether plus lomipentrin this artemether is artemisinin in derivative while lomipentrin is another anti malaria drug who recommended that anti malaria drug should not be given as a monotherapy in any form of malaria so one is artemisinin in combined with another anti malaria drug artisunate plus amodiaquin artisunate plus meploquin dihydro artemisinin in plus piperaquin is it clear 
in the second and third trimester of pregnancy the drug of choice is artemisinin based combination therapy is given for 3 days artemisinin combination therapy is not been reported any adverse effect in the second and third trimester of pregnancy on the fetus and on the mother but artemisinin combination therapy must be avoided in the first trimester because there are limited study regarding act in the first trimester we don't know whether it is safe in first trimester or not but it is safe in second and third trimester so for first trimester the drug of choice is quinine and clindamycin is given for 7 days for second and third trimester the drug of choice is act artemisinin based combination therapy is given for 3 days in case of unavailability aap artemisinin combination therapy we can use quinine plus clindamycin in the second and third trimester as well why we should why we should not use quinine and clindamycin in the second and third trimester because due to increased risk of hypoglycemia in late pregnancy why we should not use act in the first trimester because due to limited study about act safety in the first trimester i hope it is clear